So, you want to learn about a more painterly pixel art style? Well, go ahead and grab your pixel art brushes and buckle yourself in, boy. We're gonna take a look at some stuff today. I'm super excited. Hey guys, welcome on back to Touch by Kai. I'm Kai, and today we are back in a sprite once again. Taking a look at what I just said, we're gonna go ahead and do some painterly kind of stuff today. It's gonna be super cool. So, the first thing I'm gonna do is I have a, uh, a nice color here. I'm gonna grab a darker color like this, kind of kind of nice and, and saturated. And I'm gonna use this as a base color right here. So, I'm just gonna fill in a big old circle. I'm in a 64 by 64 canvas, by the way. Um, and what I want to do is I want to, I'm on, I'm on brush size number five, by the way, just got to paint in a little bit of a little head shape, I guess. Um, and I want to just take a look at some things you can do here. Cause a lot of people, they're like, Oh, I don't, you know, you have to, you have to make pixel art look like pixel art. And that's true. I really like pixel art that looks like pixel art, but sometimes it's cool to shake things up. I just want to give you guys some ideas today. So I'm going to grab a darker color, a little bit darker than the, the, the base color that we already have about something like that. Then I'm just going to drop the obesity down. Um, and then maybe a little bit more than that, uh, drop the opacity down. You can see we could just come in here and kind of like paint over top of this, which is just, it's like really super cool actually, to be honest with you. So I don't do a lot of this kind of, uh, pixel art style. You can see here, and if you go outside the lines, don't worry about that. We'll fix that later. But, um, I don't do a lot of this kind of pixel art style where it's, um, kind of painterly like this, but this is actually pretty, pretty cool. I mean, like it's not super pixel art if you're going for pixel art style, but it's definitely pretty cool. You know, it's definitely pretty neat. Um, and you could do this with, uh, with lighter colors as well. So let me just grab, oops, let me just grab a lighter color here and we're going to just turn this down a little bit. Maybe turn the opacity down. There we go. Uh, let me a little bit more than that. Cool. And you can see, we just get some really pretty cool like effects here. I don't know. Maybe you want to just try something new, uh, for a little bit, get, get a little bit, uh, of a different type of inspiration, maybe some kind of, um, maybe some kind of good art will come from it. You know, maybe sometimes you just got to switch it up. And, and do some cool, fun stuff. Um, what do I want to do for the lips? Let's just grab a super dark color, and we won't do any opacity at all. Yeah, let's do that, and then I'll just drop that down all the way to one, all the way to one. Thank you. Uh, and I'll just do like this for the for the lips. Just super, super simple. More red in there. Just something really stylistic. Like, this is super stylistic, guys. But yeah, I mean, let me just go ahead and just go in and erase the pieces that are kind of spilling over, kind of form the face up a little bit more as well. A little bit sharper there, a little bit rounder here. But yeah, so just really cool thing to kind of just play around with. Um, I know a lot of people uh, really enjoy painting and they're like, well, I, I can't really do that in... Uh, a sprite and you can you can do that in any, any pixel art application really but you can you can uh, do anything you want so pretty much like I said this video is just to kind of give you guys an idea of maybe some stuff that you could do here in pixel artville um, but yeah so I think this is pretty neat so um, something like that and I kind of want to define a little bit of a line over here some more so we're kind of just going and something like this some super stylistic maybe around the edges here as well yeah 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 all right cool so like i said just just kind of give you guys an idea of uh something different you can do with pixel art like i said pixel art is really nice and you can do a lot of things with it so i really just kind of want to reinforce that on the uh in, on the channel here just kind of uh, something like that maybe we'll kind of go around there and i kind of want to do eyes as well so we might as well just pop some eyes in real quick super rough and stylistic just the way i like it there we go super stylistic pretty cool but uh but yeah that's 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 nice maybe something like that instead yeah okay add some more white on this side oh, i wasn't fully white was it oh man i thought that was all the way white well good you shouldn't ever use white. That's a lesson right there. You only use white if you're doing like cartoony stuff, you know. Using white for painting kind of stuff is not very good. It uh it doesn't let you overlay, it doesn't let you mix things well. It's just solid whiteness, you know. All right. Super cool. I enjoy. That's a pretty fun thing to do, you know. Just this is just pretty fun. That's what this is. I I enjoy this quite a bit. If I do that one more time, I swear I got to change my keybinds. Um, 
something like that, maybe, wrapping it around, drop the opacity down, cool, yeah, I enjoy, I enjoy, alright, so I hope you guys enjoyed today's little, I wouldn't even really call it a tutorial, really, just kind of like a, um, a little tidbit, just a little, little, little tidbit thing, you know, just a little tiny, hey, you guys can do this if you really, uh, do want to, so, uh, really enjoy this kind of stuff. Like I said, this is just to kind of fresh, freshen up your brain a little bit, give a nice little, a nice little, um, break from maybe some of the types of art you were doing. Maybe some really cool things will come from it because you're doing different art styles. You definitely have a different frame of mind. Maybe you'll, it'll just, something will pop in your head and it'll be really cool. I don't know. Hope you ladies and gentlemen enjoyed it. I will see you in the next one, but until then. Bye-bye.